Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Windows 11 is upon us and well, there are some people who don't like the fact that we now have a new start menu that is obviously in the center of the screen. And some of my colleagues actually asked me, is there any way of putting the old start menu back? And actually I said, sure, just install Windows 10. But look, the reality is there are some people who are going to be holding out. They're going to want to go back to where everything was in the past. So they're going to want to move all of this over to the left-hand side. And that's fine. In the other video, we did show you how to do that. You can right-click here, go to your taskbar settings and change the alignment to the left. That's going to bring everything here over to the left. However, that really wasn't what they wanted. They wanted this whole start menu to revert back to what it used to be. So there is actually a way of doing that, but it does involve a quick registry hack. So how we'll get around this is we'll click on start. We're going to type in reg edit and we'll hit enter. That's just going to launch this registry editor. Now, if you're unfamiliar with using the registry editor, well, look, it's a... It's a place where a lot of cool stuff can happen, a lot of complex stuff can happen, a lot of bad things can happen. But in this case, as long as you follow these instructions, you should be fine. So over here on the left, we are going to expand HKey Local Machine. We're going to expand Software. Then we'll expand Microsoft. And we're going to select or expand Windows. We're then going to expand Current Version. And let me just move this across so we can see a little bit easier. We're then going to expand Explorer and we'll select Advanced. Now over here on the right, the key that we're looking for doesn't actually exist by default. So we're going to right click and in here we're going to type and you will need to get this correct. We'll type in start underscore show classic mode. All right, so we'll do that. We'll double click on it. And for the hexadecimal value, our choices here are going to be zero or a one. Now, a one is going to be reverting back to our old start menu. And if we change it to a zero or simply just delete the key that we just created, that's going to put everything back the way it is here with Windows 11. So I'm going to change this to a one. We'll click OK. We can close this now. And we are going to have to restart our machine. So I'm just going to do that. We're going to click on start. We're going to restart and I'll be back in just a second. Okay, so we just restarted. And at first glance, you might be forgiven for thinking that nothing happened because everything here is still in the middle. If we click this, you'll see, however, we have reverted back to our normal Windows 10 menu. So what you might want to do, to, I guess, to complete the look is to go into our task bar settings and align that to the left and everything is pretty much going to look the way it was. So that's going to include all of our options down the side here, obviously all of our app list and of course our tiled interface. So there you have it. If you want to move to Windows 11 but you're still holding out and you want to go back to the old way of having a Windows 10 start menu, you can certainly do that. It does involve the registry hack that we just saw. And of course, if you do want to change it back, we just click start. We're going to type in reg edit again, and we'll launch that. And of course, we've got two options now for reverting back. We could simply open up our show uh, start show classic mode. We'll change that to a zero. We can reboot and that'll put everything back. Of course, we still will have to do the additional step of moving all the icons back into the middle. In fact, let's just restart our machine. Okay, and now that we're back into the Windows 11 desktop, if I click Start, you'll notice that we now have the new Windows 11 Start menu, but obviously everything is still justified to the left. So to complete the change back, we'll open up our taskbar settings, pop everything to the center, and there we go. So if you enjoyed this video on how to take your start menu from Windows 11 and move it back to the old way, don't forget to give this video a like, comment if you like as well, and don't forget to subscribe. We're going to see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day.